I think for Africa it is very, very important because we in Africa can leapfrog to the latest technologies in, 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 in green. We can conserve our resources, the water, the environment, and we don't have to go through the learning curve that Europe or America has gone through or Asia has gone through. We can actually leapfrog to the latest. So for us, it will be far more easier. Our energy right now can be green, our water resources we can conserve. So really, it's a huge opportunity for Africa. Um, we cannot work as silos anymore. I think in the past we worked as a silo with government, private sector, NGOs, and all working independently, and everybody trying to do the same thing. This environment, planet Earth, is ours, ours together. Business cannot survive without government, government cannot survive without business, and NGOs cannot thrive if both of these were not present. So it is now time for formidable partnerships to come together from private sector, government, and business, and of course, um, from the NGOs to come in together and say, fine, let's find innovative solutions to address global problems. This planet is ours and we have to cohabit in, in it. And I think we are all interdependent too. I think as we speak today, we need to have platforms. And we don't see any other platform right now, apart from 3GF, which is talking the same language, which is talking about global green growth and talking about scaling it up to a large extent. And I think this is why 3GF becomes a very, very important. This is a movement, it's a journey, it's not a destination that we arrive one day. But it's got to continue and I think I wish it more success.